hi everyone it's me Jen and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to this episode of Jennifer Eats Taiwan so I'm actually here in animation lane which I have been to this place before if you're curious about it I will link it down below in the Taizong video but I am meeting a friend and we are going to a place called vendor which kind of looks like at least online a restaurant a bar it's about a 15 minute walk from animation lane and a four minute car ride or uber i've never been there but actually one of you guys suggested it to me on instagram so i'm gonna go check it out it looks really cool by the photos it seems like this area got a few new additions from the last time i was here because i don't remember attack on titan being here before anyways as i mentioned it's a quick walk to our destination once you're in an area that looks a bit like an outdoor market selling crafts then you'll know that you're in the right area. We've arrived at Vendor Bar and this is the secret door. Let's go. It kind of looks like a vending machine, right? But yes. actually, do 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 do. Welcome to the inside of Vendor Bar. It has dim lighting with almost a vintage luxe feel showcased through the red walls, pattern wallpaper, and plush green velvet seating. On Google Maps, it says that this spot is open every day of the week from 6 p.m. to 2 a.m. And it has a 4.7 star rating from 220 reviews. There are two levels with the first having a small seating area with what I'm assuming is the main bar, some seating and the kitchen. You can also see some of their awards showcased on this floor as well. The second floor has more seating available from tables to sofa seating, following the same luxe vintage theme as the first floor. The second floor is where we were seated. So one feature about this place is that the man said a lot of the stuff on the menu is from Singapore. So he recommended to us this Kaya toast that's from Singapore and we're gonna try it as well as a cheese platter. How cool is this? This is the cocktail menu. So these are the ingredients inside every cocktail. Yeah. And you can see right here. So for example, this cocktail right here, you can see the alcohol content. This yeah, is sweet. the sweetness level. Swan, this is the sour one, fruity. Yeah. Ah, okay, and this is sparkling. So yeah. cool. Wow, it looks so beautiful. I love that. I love this concept actually. So I like vodka. I am going to be getting a vodka base, which is <laughs> this one right here. And the alcohol level is to the max. This one is which one? This one. This one, okay. Oh, is there tea inside? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Ooh, look at the purple. It's beautiful. Look at it. Ooh, and it smells amazing. I got my cocktail. It comes in a bird cage. I've never had a cocktail like this in my life. Aren't you impressed? Yes. Cheers. Nobody's here yet, so it's okay. I don't feel so shy. But they're fully reserved past, I think, nine? Yep, here we go. I'm gonna try it. You can't, I cannot really taste the vodka. Like it's there, but it's so smooth. And it tastes like there's tea inside. I feel like the herbs in the box looked like ew, there was tea. Anyway, very smooth. I like it. Yeah, I'm wondering what like it, is it better. Yeah, that's what I. I wonder. This is from Singapore, so hello, Singapore people. You can tell me if this is actually from Singapore. What? It's really nice. So what is it? Lots of sugar, powdered sugar, sugar, butter. And that's it. So it is it's like sugar, sugar bread, I guess. Hmm. Mm. There's a taste. Wait. Like peanut butter? A bit like peanut. A little nutty. Yeah. The berry is so thick. <laughs> it's good though, isn't it? Yeah. It's different. Coconut. Oh, coconut. That's it. What you say it? I'm like, yeah. It's coconut. It's coconut. Okay, okay. There is some kiwi, some chorizo, probably some conte. Maybe. You would know, <laughs> you're from France. I'm like, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> it looks good though. I have to say, eating cheese with someone from France is a totally, it's, a, it's an experience. I'm learning so much. Literally a pearl is like, oh, this is this one, this is this one, this is this one. She smells it. Oh, this is like em Emmental. 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 I was like, what is that? 
<laughs> we got some free shots. Cheers! Cheers! That's actually delicious. Singapore sling down the hatch. Cheers to a second drink! Cheers! I actually quite enjoy this cup, it's very dainty. Ooh, this one's stronger. Well, it's strong. Very citrusy. It's nice. Actually, I think I prefer this one to the other one. I left the bar close to 9 p.m. and you can see that it was starting to pick up and more people were on the first floor. Say goodbye to Pearl. Bye. Until next time, I've been cut down. My final thoughts on Vendor is that they had great service, unique and delicious drinks. The price was a little more than average, but all in all, it was a good night. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!